Good morning, guys. Like, this is, oh my God, good Sunday morning. Start off right with coffee. Anyway, guys, had a great sleep. Slept as many hours as I could. Yes, eight full hours. Yeah, great. Great thing. I'm going to say something, and you guys are going to love it. You ready? You ready? I have a day off. But that doesn't mean I don't stop working. So in today's agenda, I'm gonna film two videos so it goes out through the week. I'm gonna do a copper drop video and a, my top five, I think fashion or shoe tip sort of thing. So you guys can know what runs through my brain when I get dressed or when I pick shoes or when I buy shoes and stuff like that. Anyway guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do enjoy or you're already enjoying this video and you enjoyed that me making a coffee, hit that thumbs up button. And if you guys wanna help us, Grow this channel, don't forget, subscribe and share. Let's start. Oh my God, what is going on in this film room? All right, let's quickly fix. Oh my God, these things fell off. Okay, look at this mess. Obviously I did, my last video I did was of my boutons and they're, oh my God. See, you guys just think this room looks clean, but this is the floor. I just stand here and no one can really tell what's going on. Hello, mate. Shout out to Mark from Sandside. I might give him a visit today, actually. Let's put these triangle square thingies back on. That goes there. This one goes up here. Yeah, how's that? Yeah. Sorry to interrupt your vlogs currently guys, time to answer some questions, I haven't done this for a couple of days now, not even a couple of days, two days and it feels like it's been forever. First question I'm going to answer is from Savage King right there. Question, when are you guys going to get married? Honestly, I have no idea. After all of these businesses are all said and done, probably then, but it, that seems fair-fetched pretty far away. Next question is by Faze Penguil. How often do you wash your hair when you have braids in it? Give me one second. This is what I use when I don't get to wash my hair. This is a conditioning spray. My hair always smells like this coconut. And it's actually really good. It makes my hair less itchy, more clean. And I do try to wash my hair at least like once every three to four days. But I don't like it because it gets really heavy and it's really annoying. If Like you guys can imagine. Lavar Ball asks once again, what's your, what's yours and Philly's favorite sneaker of all time? My personal favorite sneaker of all time right now is the as always is Jordan 11 breads. Babe, what's your favorite sneaker? <laughs> the one that I wear all the time, the one that is my band, because they're comfy. She likes her bands, that's pretty much it. Last question for right now, I really feel like this is a great question. I, I love this one. I love these type of questions, to be honest. Sour cream asses. How do you manage your time and money so well? How do I manage my time really well? I don't. I honestly, you guys might seem like it might seem on camera and on on whatnot and how much work I actually get done. I manage my time really poorly because I'm spending 18 to 16 hours of a day working, just continuously grinding, working, working, working. I have a problem not being able to delegate the work correctly, and I always have this stubborn feeling in the back of my mind that I can do anything better than anyone else that I can pay to get done. This is a problem that I will always have. I've, I don't have trust in people as of yet, that because I, I have such, I'm not gonna say I, a huge, uh, skill set but my skill sets are able has been able to take me where i am at the moment so i feel like whatever i'm doing is working but i know i'm starting to lose more and more time therefore i can't do anything so i got to delegate my works for example one of my things that i'm loving right now is toby toby's helping me like a whole heap with the cocaine instagram taking the photos doing all the photo shoots things i just can't do anymore i don't have time for it so as a favor for me to to him or like a blessing or a gift can you guys do me one a favor one favor for this vlog and this vlog only this is his instagram handle i want you guys to follow him and support him because i am supporting his dream and he's helping me with my dream how do i spend my money or how do i manage my money so well i have realized now that i used to spend a lot of money on shoes i used to spend a lot of money on clothes but now 
I'm restricting myself and I'm investing all that money back into all my businesses. Like, barbershop was not cheap to open, I'm not even gonna lie. Sneaker laundry, definitely, like, I'm gonna give you guys the ballpark figure of how much it cost us to open sneaker laundry, $120,000. Hundred and twenty grand. Yep, that's right. And I've literally just invested thirty grand more into cocaine, and then I invested twelve thousand dollars into an embroidery machine. Add the mats up. I've invested all my money. They're like I've saved so much money. You can be like, wow, how'd you guys get? How'd you get all that money? I haven't spent a dollar. Like I've been putting my money and building my money on all side projects. A lot of just hustling, as in like like selling my brand, uh, doing a lot of DJ work, and, and I just saved. I put away a lot of money. I really, really put away a lot of money. And I, I was really stingy on a lot of things. And what, I have to admit, reselling, a lot of Bape and Supreme helped. So I would never knock on resellers' hustle at all because I know they're getting their money and they're getting it some way. And I mean, you just gotta make money somewhere. I never knock someone's hustle. Anyway, guys, let's uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's get back to the vlog. Uh, a lot of you guys always wonder what these are. These are the cause dissected 400%. These are really, really rare, and I spent a lot of money on these dumbass plastic toys. But I don't care because I like them. They come in three different colorways. This is one of my favorite ones. This was a must. Ever since I was a young child, I always would love one of these toys. And it matches my jumper right now, which is awesome. That's done. I'm gonna somehow incorporate the big ass bear brick. I don't know how, where I'm gonna put it. I might put a little stand here, have it sitting up so people can see it. Cause that's what Mark wanted as well. He wanted me to feature that bear brick in all my videos. That's one of the reasons why he gave it to me. Let's continue to say. Just finished filming. You know what? I changed it like two or three times. I did like 10 tips and then I did it five. And then I just kept going back and forth. And yeah, it was really, really annoying. Anyway, guys, how do you guys like this setup? How nice does this look? And do you know what I realized? How annoying is the iPhone 10? Like you have to get this adapter to actually plug anything into your phone. Look how nice this lighting is. I'm going to show you guys what the standard lighting in this room looks like. Ready? One, two, three. This is the standard lighting in this room. How ridiculous is this? Anyway guys, we're going to uh, actually start sewing, not sewing, embroidering Yo-Yo's, uh, her jumper. If you guys don't know who Yo-Yo is, it's the Saint Side Dog. And uh, yeah, shout out to Archie for this awesome Secudo jumper. Oh my god, you guys just got to see this detail. Look, it's like this fluffy, it's so cool. And it's done on a champion reverse weave hoodie as well. Damn, that's impressive. The Saint Side jumper is on its way it was a freaking headache to get but it's working well i'm happy with it look oh man it got bam and we have like how long do you have until we get do we have to leave the same time and what's on our close um less than half an hour 23 minutes to be exact <laughs> so let's see if we make this are you jealous that your friend yo, -yo oh oh okay are you jealous that yo, -yo gets a jump and you don't you don't even like jumpers you don't even like jumpers Whoa, your hair is so bright on Dude, camera. Dude, it's really bright. Holy. It's like neon. Yeah, damn. It's a neon color. Hey, yo. Hey, oh, yo. Oh, you really oh. want to go for the sure, camera? Sure. Yeah. Whatever, because it comes as a square. Now it's time to go to Woolworths, and of course he's with me, so he's going to ruin this whole favorite trip of mine. Why is it called Woolworths? Because that's what it's called. But why do they sell wool? They make it the wool worth your money. What the hell? That makes no sense. <laughs> Look, it's me. How do you know that's a good avocado? How do you know? Is it because it's I cheap? Touch it. It's a dollar fifty. Is it because it's cheap? Yeah. It's not a good one. Sales. It's a good one. <laughs> Look, I'm touching it. It's hard. Is it supposed to be hard? Is that a good one? It's very hard. <laughs> Only a useful thing I am for is getting toilet paper. Hey, here you go. Hey. I got the only thing that matters. I got you toilet paper because you poop a lot. Hey. Poopy, poopy, poopy. Hey, this is for you because you poop a lot. 
Inshallah, stop. Stop what? Is that what it's for? Gonna get sponges. This supermarket is playing Chris Brown and they have the lyrics on the background. So random. How's your flowers? I've got flowers for myself because he doesn't buy flowers for me. <laughs> Did you notice they were playing the lyrical videos on the background? <laughs> That's what I was showing. <laughs> Not because you were buying flowers, baby. <laughs> but so cheap, five dollars for this whole bunch. What a bargain. <laughs> I've been putting off my car and working on my car for a while. I purchased some goods from the homies at GK Tech. These are 15 mil spaces and I want to put them on in the rear. You guys will be like, why, why? My tire doesn't stick out as much as I want it. And this should, oh yes. So if this fits underneath here, that means the space that I'll get is perfect. If you guys look from this angle, the rear tire sticks in more than the front tire. This is called, uh, this is all car jargon. All right, let's watch me. Philly bought this for my birthday a while ago and I feel really bad because I don't use it as much as I want to. And it's the best thing ever. I also bought brand new lug nuts. These are the brand new ones, all black, and these are the old ones, all rusted, and they're thicker as well. So look how much thinner this is. I prefer these ones over these ones, easily. This side is already done, and look how much, what, oh my God. This kind needs to be lowered as well, a tad more. So I wanna tuck the wheel in properly. Oh wow, that looks really, really sticking out but if you look at this side at the front see now this looks like what the back one used to look like this is what the old wheel looks like i mean the old lug nuts on the front on my old tires can't be bothered changing that right now but i'll show you guys what the new one looks like bam oh my god look how much nicer it is all black and brand new yeah if you guys are wondering what wheels i run work sp ones i'm pretty sure Really aggressive as well. Something I get annoyed at and it's very petty of me, but this is gold, so I've bought another one which is black. They're only like five bucks, so this is annoying. I'm gonna take this off. Oh my God, it's black. I prefer the black look over this gold look. It just looks more stealth and it's cool. If anyone knows what this actually does, comment below and good job if you know. We are currently at Tracy's house playing ping pong. We're actually having a meeting, but secretly me and Philly are just going to keep playing. It is currently how are you being turned away? I think how is currently winning, but they're getting really, really into it. Let's go. Oh, Look at his stance right now. Thank you for watching our video guys, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, always don't forget to go ham on that thumbs up button. Any question you guys want me to answer, hang on, I need to change the lighting, hang on, give me one second, one second. 
literally turning on that one extra light makes a whole bunch of difference. Thank you for watching that video, guys. Anyway, let's answer a few more questions before this vlog ends. This one right here. Um, Joe X, J O H X, how much is a haircut at Legacy? All male haircuts start at $35. Children's haircuts start at $25. And if you're a student and you show a student ID, the haircut's only $30, which is a great deal. As a Chio at questions, how was how has vlogging this change? How has vlogging this far? Sorry, what the hell is wrong with my English? How has vlogging this far changed your life? You know what? It's changed a lot. I I have to admit it. Um, it's it's so weird how many people uh, watch you and then sometimes you feel like you're the only person that feels that way or thinks that way, but obviously there's twenty. Two other thousand people that think and enjoy what we do for a living in life and and people see things the way I see things and it's incredible it's actually incredible being able to share my life with you guys and come to an understanding that people out there have the same understanding as me and the same views on life or even clothing sneakers business and if I I personally felt like this is a great way for me to give back to people I didn't have a a what 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 would be called a channel or a way not, like not a channel as in a YouTube channel but like a channel of a way that I can give back to people and I felt like this is the great way I can give back to people so if people actually want advice or want to learn something from this they can just watch my YouTube channels and be like oh you know what get some sort of motivation get some sort of answer get some sort of clarity I don't care what you guys get from this but as long as you guys enjoy this and keep smiling and enjoy your day you know it's a massive Thumbs up for me, to be honest. And the great thing is, it's cool, it's fun. It's made me learn a lot of things, about, literally about our, myself, about Philly, about our relationship. Man, there's a lot of things that's changed, actually. I, like, I really wish I could sit here and just like really deeply think about this question, but honestly, it's changed a lot. When Nika Kobe asks, 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 when are you guys coming to America? We are planning to go to America real soon. Wow, no, not real soon. Like as as fast as we can, because that's something we really want to spend like a full month in. And right now, my money's really tight, my time's really tight, and I'm being stingy. So I don't think holidays anytime soon. We we are going away though in the next couple of days, but that's like just something me, Jamie, Josh, and their girlfriends and my girlfriend have all been planning for the last like year. See, so it took us a year to plan a three day getaway in the same freaking state, like an hour drive. That's how horrible of time I barely have. That makes no sense, but you understand what I'm saying? I just wanna, I, this, ha, this is not even a question. This answered my my thing Uh Video maker 2199, do a mukbang. That's exactly what Philly wants us to do. And I have no idea why people watch that. Someone, please tell me why people watch mukbangs. It's freaking weird. This question right here. I really feel like this is something I want, everyone asks me when I, drop one of those like videos that I stand there and talk. Hey man, where do you get those Hexagon shapes from? They're all from Kmart. Everything, nearly 90% of that backdrop, like hardware wise, is made from Kmart. Like, it looks good, doesn't it? Yeah, I probably spent like 100 or $150. And all the toys and stuff like that, yeah, that's a whole different story. Anyway guys, enjoy this video. I'll speak to you guys tomorrow. I appreciate every single one that comments and if, I don't reply to your comments, I will reply to you manually via my keyboard. If not, I'll speak to you guys next time. Peace. None of that made sense. I don't care. I'll speak to you guys tomorrow.